Hey, how's everyone doing today? We are reviewing Dan Post Shark Skin Boots. Probably my favorite. I wouldn't say casual. I'd say this is the best yard work boot you can get. So easy to clean. Leather is always going to be the best, best. But if you like exotics like myself, you're always going to love a shark skin. Impossible to break. I can literally, like, I'll, like, I'll even risk, risk it for the boot right here. You cannot damage this thing. You can, you can go without conditioning for a lot longer than other boots. I still highly recommend. Don't do that every day, but I just want to do it to prove how scuff proof. If I did that to my lizard pair that I did a, a, a review on yesterday, I would have broke a couple scales. Almost guaranteed, but definitely would cause some damage. This thing is impossible to break, and we're gonna do some close-in. Starting to get some better quality on the videos, but you can see how great the skin looks. It's just badass. I mean, that's just something that gives me some testosterone, man. Saying I'm wearing some shark skins, you you can't get past that. I used to be a big Jordans guy. I used to always have boots in my family, but. You start to, when you get a little older, you start to say, man, I don't care what nobody thinks. This is what I like. And this makes me feel more manly. Makes me feel like I can lift more. This is shark skin. You're wearing a freaking shark. The origin of these skins, I would like to talk about more about the origin. For people that are conscious about where it comes from, it is not illegal. It's not from any endangered species. It's a side product of the Asian food trade of sharks so nothing gets wasted especially when it comes to lizards and caimans and alligators they're everywhere the basic caiman and allig uh, american alligator is not in danger at all the least in danger of all crocodilian species but these um i have another pair that's from sand shark this shark i don't remember exactly where it's from i can probably find out soon but it's gonna take me a little bit of research because this one i haven't done too much on but Dan Post is a very reliable company. Let's put that in light. Beautiful, beautiful boot. 10 out of 10, we'll recommend. Um, but, so enough of all talking, let's put this on. Got some better jeans today. Left a couple moments of silence, but now we'll start talking again. These boots are just so damn comfortable. So damn reliable. I can kick some, stub my toe. These will not give in. These boots will last you a lifetime. Condition them. Even, you can even go crazy with some of these boots. You can take them dancing. You can take them working. These boots are amazing. Almost as durable as elephant, if not just as. Walk around and back up a little bit. Now, per usual, how many glasses of bourbon would I have with this boot? I can get blackout drunk, sloppy drunk, which you shouldn't, but sometimes it just happens with these. These will be more protected than my own body would if I got that drunk. These boots will last you. Amazing. These boots, the only thing, complaint I have, me personally, I would prefer a J-Toe, but I haven't found any by Dan Post. I love this brand, Dan Post is amazing. It makes a J-Toe. <sighs> but yeah, this boot is the one thing that I don't care if it's square toe. This boot is a nine out of 10. Very, very sleek look durable as anything you can get and still looks pretty good and comfy as hell it feels sturdy when you squeeze it but on the inside 
just so soft, it's just amazing. But half of that is just because Dan Post is a good company. The other half is just shark skin, it's just amazing. You're not gonna regret buying these. Highly recommend. Um, they'll be a little expensive. You want them used on eBay, you can get them for pretty cheap. I see them go for 60, 70, 80, up to 150, but brand new, you're gonna spend a little bit. So if you're going for high-end boots like Luke Casey, you're gonna spend about 600, 700, maybe even more. Custom boots around 6, 500. Depends how custom you go. These boys, they are 400, but sometimes you can get them on special. Just depends on your size though, because I'm an 11 and a half. These boots were $300, because all they had was 11 and a half and like two other sizes over at Boot Barn. But yeah, Boot Barn, I recommend more getting boots somewhere else, but Boot Barn sometimes just has good deals. You can't, excuse me, you can't be a good deal. So yeah. Dan Post Shark Boots, 9 out of 10, amazing boot, I highly recommend. You can wear it with almost anything, but this boot, highly recommend, just from jeans, casual, that's just a square toe look. Got yourself a J-toe shark, you might you can even rock it with a suit if you really want to. But yeah, I'm Gabi No Sino, this is the Dan Post Shark Boot, 9 out of 10, let me know if you buy it, I would really appreciate it, let me know what you think about it. Um, any comments or anything like that leave them in the bottom and yeah hope you have a great day thank you for listening take care now